Hey everybody, Siki here, and I'm coming to you guys with another video. So before I get started, just in case anyone wants to know, I'm gonna tell you what I have on my lips. And also I have a video coming up on all of these lipsticks. I have not done it yet, but it's definitely coming because I have to share with you guys. But this is Magnolia Makeup Lipstick, and it is in the color Midnight Violet, and it is a cream matte lipstick and you guys know how I feel about them okay so this is from Magnolia makeup like I said it is from their velour galore collection and I'm rocking max night moth lip liner with it okay so now what I came to talk to you guys about is my haul from BeautyCon okay now I did not think that I was gonna have much of a haul because I really didn't plan on going there to get stuff but I received a lot of products to show you guys and some of them I have used before, but let's just, enough of the talking, let me just show you so you can see. So if you guys remember in my monthly favorites, I talked about this agave oil and you can see that I have really been using this stuff. Well, guess what? I saw them at BeautyCon, okay? And I got another oil, like I am, like my day was made, okay? So I have a whole nother oil and they also have the oil in spray form and it is called Revitalizing Shine Spray. And it's agave healing oil also. They said the formula is pretty much the same as the bottle with the dropper, but you can spray it. And that's what I did this morning. I sprayed a little bit on my little ponytail or my little bun and I'm heading out. And they said that is exactly what it's for. They are just launching this. So I'm not really sure of the price, but I will look it up. And if I find it, I will put it in the description box. Okay, but it's the spray. I'm super duper stoked. And this is like my bag, okay? So this is what we're about to go through. The next thing I got from Agave is a restorative hydrating mask. And this is a deep conditioner for your hair. So I have not found a Holy Grail deep conditioner yet. So I am excited to try this. And that is what it looks like. It has the plastic cover on it. It smells just like the Agave oil. And I love the smell of this whole product line. Like it is just... It smells good. Next from Luster, I received a Pro Light Teeth Whitening System and it has some strips in there and I have not opened it yet, but it says it does not cause tooth sensitivity and that is what the kit looks like. So I will definitely be using this and I will let you guys know how it works. Now, if you guys know, I don't usually use teeth whitening systems on my teeth. I usually use peroxide and I just use it maybe like three times a week and I just swish it around in my mouth and that's how I keep my teeth white but I am anxious to try this. So not only did they give us a teeth whitening system but they also gave us some toothpaste. This is what the toothpaste looks like and it I promise it smells like spearmint but it says luster now instant whitening toothpaste anti-cavity fluoride toothpaste okay and that's what it looks like up close. Now, because you guys saw the BH Cosmetics bag, I want to talk to you about the stuff I got from BH Cosmetics. So I received a brush set, okay? And this is their Pop Art Collection brush set. And this is what it looks like. I believe I've showed this in a haul and I've done a giveaway. And the brushes are different colors. Like the, the handles are different colors. And it's a really nice little set it comes with a spoolie it comes with a blending brush it comes with a contour brush foundation brush i mean you probably can travel with this and be able to do a full face of makeup so that's the pop art brush collection the next item is foundation primer from bh cosmetics waterproof eye primer from bh cosmetics an anti-shine product from bh cosmetics this one is in the color starlit and that's what that looks like and this is an illuminating bronzer. And this one is in the color Siren. And it is a bronzer as well. I have some Studio Pro Matte Finish Pressed Powder. And this one is in the color 255. That's 255. And I was playing in it. And let me tell you about this. I thought that this one would be a perfect match for my skin. But when I put just a little dab on my face, it actually, you know, I don't want to say it oxidized, but it did look a little bit darker on my face than it looked in the pan. Okay, so I also have 250. And 250 is what I'm wearing today on top of my Clinique foundation. And this is 250. So far, so good. I put it on top of my Clinique foundation and I set it with my setting spray. 
And you wouldn't think that this one would be my perfect match, but it is perfect though. The next item is their new eyeshadow palette and it is BH Party Girl After Hours. I actually have the Party Girl palette and I like it. And this one is After Hours so it has some deeper colors in it, like colors for you to do smoky eyes with. So that's what that looks like up close and personal. Has some really pretty colors in here. And I went by the Shea Moisture booth and I received some coconut and hibiscus dry oil mist spray. It is for brightening and toning. So because it's for brightening and toning, I'm assuming that it is for your body. And then they have a super fruit complex hand and body scrub with mango butter and green coffee bean extract. It is for contouring, firming, and smoothing. So the next item is Jamaican Black Castor Oil Strengthen, Grow, and Restore Treatment Mask with shea butter, peppermint, and keratin. It's for natural, chemically processed, color-treated, or heat-styled hair. It is to nourish, rebuild, and grow. And that is what it looks like. Now this is new from their Jamaican Black Castor Oil line. So I am looking forward to trying this too because as I said, I have not found a Holy Grail deep conditioner. So now I have two to try. Lastly, I have some nail polish from Salon Perfect and it is special effects top coat. It has like some type of confetti inside of a top coat and you're just supposed to put it on top of your nails, I guess. But you guys know I like doing design so I'm interested in trying it. And here's another one with like black and white dots in it. And then this is just a blue glitter. So that's it for the goodies that I received from Beautycon. If I left anything out, which I may have, I will show you guys in another video. But don't forget, if there is a review or if there's a first impression that you guys would like to see, please let me know and I will definitely do it. I don't have a problem doing it, okay? So that's it for this video. Um, if you guys like the video, don't forget to thumbs up and share it if you like because I don't mind at all. So until the next video, you guys have an awesome, blessed day and I will see you sooner than you think. Bye.